Ladies and gentle people in the world. What's going on, y'all? We are playing some black-white auras. And there's a lot of shitbirds in this deck for sure. I hope you guys are ready. Where did my freaking cable go? I got a charging cable for my for my mouse. And I don't know where it is now. That's disconcerting. Because it's just gone. Um <laughs> Alright, well anyway. <clears throat> hope it doesn't hope my mouse doesn't die, then we gotta have an issue. Anyway. Al Seed of Life's Bounty. Sacrifice a target creature or enchantment you control gains protection. That's a nice little bit. And it's an enchantment creature. Whenever an enchanted creature dies, draw a card for each aura you control that was attached to it. So this is like, hey man, don't worry about it. We got you. You want to throw all these enchantments on, dude? That's cool. Um, also, if a creature dies that you dead weight, you draw cards for that too. Also, if a creature dies that you Myers Grasp, you draw cards for that too. You can also sacrifice an enchantment for final payment to kill any creature. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. All the glitters, obviously, going to be uh, buffing your dudes, preferably lifelinkers. Or, well, the, both both these have lifelinks, so. This guy makes your enchantments cheaper. Uh, and whenever you an enchantment you control is put in a graveyard, put a 1-1 one, one counter on them. So, obviously, like, plus 1, 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 escape, plus 1, plus 1. Treacherous Blessing, 3 mana. Uh, this is great to sacrifice to final payment. So, that's pretty cool. Uh, Timurite Calls the Dead. This is going to go to the graveyard by itself. And it's going to make some Zombos, <clears throat> hopefully, because you can exile your own enchantments, which you have a lot of. Archon of Sun's Grace, obviously great. Cavalier of Dawn. Uh, you can return an artifact or an enchantment from your graveyard to your hand when it dies. Finally a use for this. And Elspeth Conquers Death, which is great. I think this card is fantastic. I think this card is better than Elspeth herself. So we're going to go here. Let's see if we got anything good. Otherwise, we're just using Cryptic Command. It's just always Cryptic Command. Come on. And <clears throat> what's our main... Is it that? It's this one. Let's use this one. And sideboard, we have two Dawn of Hope, also an enchantment, two Devout Decree, three Agonizing Remorse, one more final payment, one Kenoros, which I two Kenoros, which I kind of like a lot, two Kaya's Wrath, one one more Cavalier of Dawn, one Elspeth, and one Heliod's Intervention. No Noxious Grasp, which is interesting, but maybe we don't need it. Let's find out. Let's. I remember seeing a stream where someone forgot they could sacrifice captive audience to the final payment. Is that good? I forgot what Captive Audience does, to be quite honest with you. Guys, where is my frigging cable? Hold on, let me check this box over here while we wait. <clears throat> oh, I think I know what I... I, I, think, I know what charging cable I was using I was using this uh, this Xbox Elite controller so I was just using its charging cable so I'm just gonna have to take it back out it was all packed away for the move but I'm gonna take it out for now so I can charge my mouse before I leave <coughs> um yeah this hand seems fine Okay, so what does this say? Brettles. Uh, at the beginning of here, choose one. <coughs> bah. Oh, so the opponent, you give it to them, and they're like, man, I have no way to get rid of this final pain. I thought that was me, actually. I thought that was one of my opponents. I feel like that's happened to me before. Um, We're just going to go Hateful 8 along. The Hateful 8 along. so mad I didn't get these. I'm so mad. It's like not even a reasonable amount of madness. Three, four life linker. <clears throat> Come at you. Oh man, we're so we're so lifed up, dude. No one knows better than McCain.
Yeah, I'll keep that. <clears throat> Do we get to draw a card from this? Are they going to counter it? That'd be insane. <clears throat> oh, get what? No, the um, the unhinged lands. They're so great. These are my favorite lands in paper, too. Oh, yeah. Give me that treacherous. If they have a removal spell and they just chose not to, like, bounce this guy. Why wouldn't you bounce in response to the other one so I don't draw a card? That's fascinating. I'm fascinated. Oh, wow. That's all. That's a lot of treacherous. This is... <clears throat> Man, we get to go Eidolon into Treacherous, draw three cards, and make two Pegasus next turn. That's crazy. Is that an enchantment too? Oh boy. Oh, you got it, man. You got it. <coughs> oh, man, you got it. You got lifelink? Alright, I'll get it. Man. Enchantment lands. Yes, no, no. Definitely not. Brett, haven't we learned our lesson from artifact lands? Two mana? Sure. Your heart can overcome any challenge. I feel like we've we should have learned our lesson. Artifacts are just better. That's that's hateful. Can I get this little this little donger out here? Make a two two. This game seems late. Make a two two. Draw a card. that guy at this juncture, so. Stay away from my brother. Like, you know what's better than tapping Sarah Sanctum for a million white? Tell me, is it tapping Teleri Academy for, Academy for a million blue? Okay, an, an island. <laughs> it's tapping, it's tapping a single island for one blue mana. Jesus. All right, well, I still feel like we're ahead because we have three, four, five, six, we have nine power in the air, and that seems good. <clears throat> I'm no expert here, but he always says that, but he is an expert. I'll lose a life. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay, we're only at 29, guys. Oh, Super Fritz, what's going on, my dude? Oh, what up, Alan? Or rather, sup, Alan? Alan, now we're now there's no confusion, buddy. Ooh. Yep, you got it. That is a six. That's a six-five, good buddy. <clears throat> no, <laughs> you know we have. Yeah, it's only taken me. God, too long. It's got trample. Yeah, all right, I'll take six. I'll go to twenty-three. 
They have one card in hand. Eight months? Alan, are you counting the months? It's aggressive. I don't want to take four, but I kind of do, because, like... Who cares? <laughs> what are you going to do? I'm, I, I have so much life that I'm taking four damage just to draw one card. Whatever, I'll put this on here. It's inventory night, my dude. I'm counting all the meatballs. What did we draw? Oh, nothing because it didn't go to the graveyard. All right, you can go there, and then all of these... Be I guess we could just kill them, right? Okay, we'll just kill you. <clears throat> okay, you're dead. Wait, isn't, isn't what with black does? What did I miss? Oh, deal taking four damage to draw one card? Yeah. Yeah, probably. All right, so red, and they're playing red and blue. All right. What do we care about here? <clears throat> Grimdagos 3 Grid, it's actually pretty good. It gets rid of Royal Scions, the Kraken, and the Brazen Borrower, so I'll, I'll, I'll add you. Um, I don't think we need this. I don't hate a discard spell against them. Do you work at Ikea? <laughs> oh, good stuff. Good stuff. I think this is actually fine. Let me be honest with you. Our deck seems great. <clears throat> yeah, I'm just going to submit like this. I make masterpieces such as meatballs and pepper jack and mayo, as well as teriyaki subs with chocolate chip cookies. To Fucking disgusting. <coughs> no, dude. Absolutely not. Look at the size of this lock I bought for my for the budget truck we rented. It's actually massive. It's very, very heavy. Um, yeah, I'll keep this hand. I don't think it has the same engine-like capabilities as the previous hand did, but that's okay. Oh, I wonder if I could put it in my ear. I bet I could, right? Oh, wow. It's a little thick. Yeah, that's a little thick. That's a thick boy. Okay, well, what about this one? Is this one any bigger? No, I'll probably just tear my earlobe. <coughs> Tutu, huh? The lock picking lawyer? What is that? That sounds... That sounds like something, my dude. Look, man, that just got awkward. <laughs> That's what we're going for here, though. I'm not here for normalcy, guys. If you guys are watching the stream, here, it's like, oh, here's a totally normal Magic the Gathering player. Nah, bro. Well, that's annoying, because now I can't do both of these things. <laughs> Classic, Frank. Wow, that's so accurate. It's so sadly true. No one, no. I'm going to negate your Timurette calls the debt. Oh, they're not going to negate it. Oh, yeah. 
Uh, exile a creature or an enchantment card. Um, let's get this guy. Open. Our deck is sweet. This deck is sweet. I'm having a good time. See, look, this is all it takes. All I have to do is not play against the cat combo, and we're having a good time. <clears throat> wow, this guy's getting aggressive. Though. Um, I guess we'll get the other, another Timurit Calls the Dead. Tim, Tim, Timmy. Timmy! Oh, are these enchantment zombies? Oh, no, they're not. They're just regular zombies. That's boring. <clears throat> what is this? You're a cryptic command? You can bounce this guy and counter? That's cool. What is this? I don't know what this does. Can you show me the card? <laughs> I don't know what card it is. <clears throat> what are you doing? Is this bounce the thing? What does it do? Why can't I see the fucking card? There we go. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? I don't think that did anything, but... Right click on it? That's what I got. To, oh, and it brings it up over there. Gotcha. Appreciate it. Pre Shamerson Klein Gaming. <sighs> okay, well, now we're just playing this guy. And <clears throat> just YOLOing it away. Uh, let's get land and Timurit calls the dead out of here. You gonna shock it in response? That'd be funny. I'd laugh. No, you didn't. Alright, so what's the guy? Gain X life or X is the number of zombies you control. So we're gonna gain one and scry one. That seems just fine. We also get to play Cavalier. Destroy an only permanent controller creates a 3 3 golem. We can actually get rid of the sentinel's eyes and then we get this guy gets a counter and we get that seems good right interesting that this happens in the main phase though so you don't get to uh um bottom. oh and this guy gets buffed oh that's rude yeah that's fine all right i'm not I ain't too broken up about that. I mean, we could sack this and protect him. But I kind of like the life gain here. <clears throat> and I also want to play Cavalier this turn. Hmm. Pro red. I think it's like a 5-5. Five, five? We just hope they don't their last card's not another shock and or else we get absolutely blown out. <clears throat> Red these. Let's get rid of Treacherous and the Alcid, I guess. Uh, 
Um, yeah, that seems good. Eight, yeah. So now they're on a two-turn clock, and they their brazen bar can't block. Tim Rich just be texted dead. Why are you calling me? Can you text me, please? Um, okay, so your last card has to be Dece. Can't be a shock. Could be another Brazen Borrower. Scorching Dragonfire, huh? Okay. It's not bad. They get to deal five to us. Sure. I spent the day staring at two laptops while my tech friend worked on them remotely. God, what a time to be alive. Oh yeah, emergence zone, my dude. <clears throat> yeah, we're just gonna keep running it back. satisfying sound right can you guys hear that this unlocking sound oh yeah that looked like it goes real high that's satisfying um <clears throat> yeah I'll keep this it does sound like a Zippo. Yeah, that's actually true. It sounds like the flicking open and closing of Zippo. Oh my god, it cost two? Fudge! I thought it cost one because last game it cost one because we had the guy out. Oh, that was the dumbest thing I could have done. And now we're dead to this stupid deck, so that's cool. Oh, wow. I'm just like, here, I'm going to take two against your stupid mono red deck. Loud whisper. Hey, guys, we're just going to... Kind of like that. Yep. This is rough. Wow. The old post-combat shock. What's even happening right now? Where is this? In their hand? Why is this off to the side? Oh, because they lit the stage up? Hmm. Well? I mean, if they have a land, they get to kill us, right? Like, it's not even close. This guy's a six, seven... Oh, they did not. Oh, they, yeah, they can still have it. No, they can't. Yes, they can. Maybe. Oh, God. No, no, they can't now, but. Three, four, five. No, they're. Thank you. Oh, they can actually. Three, four, yeah. Oh, well, that's insane. 
Snoozle move. Thanks so much for the resub, buddy. I actually don't know what that is. Yep. Go to three. Totally reasonable. I mean, technically it would be a five, guys. Even if we get a blocker, the Ember Cleave is just too good. We're just gonna... Just can't All right, I'll translate this. I'll translate it for you. We're doing it. Happy New Year to you too, my dude. Happy New Year to you too. Okay, so things that are too slow. <clears throat> Elspeth conquers death. Cavalier. Uh, Treacherous blessing's a little scary. Gain twice X life? Yeah, sure. Devout decree, sure. Um, Kaya's wrath seems decent here. All that glitters seems a little aggressive. Actually, I want this dog. But Frank would be eating fries and peanuts. What does that mean? It hardens that? What does that mean? What's even happening right now? I will play first. <clears throat> I will keep this hand. See, now I'm tempted to do this. I'm just tempted to run this guy out there. I'll take the two this time. I would be. I would actually have a veggie sandwich from Five Guys, which is basically everything that goes on the burger, but no burger, and it's just totally fine with me. They're probably like, all right, let's see if you actually want to play a creature this turn. And I'll be like, I do. <clears throat> Good to know this is legendary because I probably would have just thrown this out there like a maniac. Oh, that seems good. I bet Moochel has one for his collection. What, one of their hot dogs? I don't know if he has a hot dog collection, and if he does, I don't know if he keeps it current. Run away, stinking, never coming back. This guy's not haste, right? Got him. He said he did? He said he had a hot dog collection? Oh, that's weird. That's weird. Why is he so weird? I can't deal with him. Um... Yeah, I mean, this is fine. Like, if you have Rimrock Knight and you want to use a Rimrock Knight and a Runaway Steamkin uh, and trade with my 3-3 and I gain 3 life, like, I'm Totally down with that. Also fine. Still a two for one and I'm getting three. Like, sure. <clears throat> a land and a fervent champion. That's not bad. Alright, so we got one dog. And this is exile and enchantment. We're at 21. Good lord, man. Tim, Tim, Timorite. Um, let's get rid of the dog, unfortunately, but I want to have enchantments to exile for my milady. Oh, yeah, we'll keep that on top for sure. Let's get rid of this guy. Oh, yeah, well, look at this. We're way ahead right now, my dudes. Look at this Motley crew of idiots over here. Let's get rid of Meyer. 
Do I care about any of these guys? Not really. I mean, we get to draw a card from this, so that's kind of cool. Jeez. <clears throat> I feel like Wrathing here is terrible. They get a 1-1 one, one, and then we lose, like, a bunch of creatures, so. Oh, wow, I was trading two Weaselback for one... <laughs> Sure. So we gain six life next turn. Seven, eight. We got it. Let's draw an Archon. Can we draw an Archon? Eidolon number dose. Um, do I care about either of these? I kind of care about this, but not really. I guess both are fine. Feels like I could be getting somewhere. attacks. Yeah, I'm at a point where I can just cast this on this guy and take the five. I don't even care. This is whenever an enchanted creature dies. Okay, so... Choose... I'll pay the five. I'll go to 18. That's kind of how you can tell your way ahead when you're when you're willing to take seven damage to kill one creature against the red deck. Red is heck, Ben. <laughs> Where's your cards, red deck? Oh, I squandered them. Heck, Ben. All right, let's see if we can finish things off for the arousing victory. Uh, how many impossible offers are you on the road trip? Probably, I mean, that's actually a great, it's a great option for me. But, I mean, pretty much every fast food place has something I can eat, so. Also, Hardee's and Carl's Jr. now have Beyond Things. Dunkin' Donuts does. So, like, there's a ton of, of uh, fake meat options that are that are possible. Um, yeah, keep this up. 
We play this, then we Myers grasp something. That seems good. Dude, the impossible breakfast sandwich is actually legit. I was impressed. I had the sausage egg one, and I was like, this is fucking real good. this because like either way we're gonna get a creature next turn but i'd rather have this survive a turn and it's more likely she's going to uh i'm not a true vegetarian i just prefer to avoid eating meat and i eat very little meat and i only eat like white meat like chicken turkey things like that um yeah this seems better it fills our yard for the ephemia oh man i would have loved the archon oh i should have taken the archon actually because if we don't hit another I guess we're I guess we're gonna trigger this before too long, so sure. I mean we do have to draw another white source for Heliod's intervention, but yeah. Oh that's great. Okay, this is actually fine. I mean we're taking two here, but like our board is very, very good. Get rid of dead weight. Yeah, this deck seems great. The, the lifelink coupled with like the amount of creatures you can amass seems very, very good against the red deck. I mean, I, I assume one of your cards is Embercleave, so... Embercleave it up, my dude. Oh, you're just gonna give them a plus. And they both have first strike. The onboard trick. That was a good one. That was a good one. I uh, did not play around the onboard trick. I guess we'll just have to do it over. Oh boy. Um, yep, next this guy. We are not attack. Uh, yeah, it's fine. Yep, still need another white source. That was a pretty terrible, uh, pretty terrible combat last turn. Let's try again. Now they're like, no, I drew Ember Cleave. And I'm like, okie dokie. I guess we still kill it. Yep. Okay, and total whiffs, whiffs all day. Does this cost three? Hmm. Hmm. Well, I kind of just want to destroy this because that seems like the best option. I guess we also play Treacherous Blessing and then Final Payment to get rid of whatever they equip. Yeah, that seems good. It also makes sure we can hit our land drops, which we already did this turn, clearly. Uh, but next turn we can play Alcide and... Yeah, alright, this is pretty good. Thank you! Kyers, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Glad you got the move figured out. Vegas isn't that far. A lot of things aren't that far from Utah, surprisingly. Is intervention an instant? Yes, it is, thankfully. Okay, resolves. Pass to the attackers. Uh, I will sack an enchantment. Kill this guy. Sack this guy. Are they close enough in texture to meat? Yeah, they taste exactly like meat. Well, that's rude. But at least we're definitely going to have a... Oh, we're not going to have anything. Well, that's sad that you would do that. Well. 
That was a good draw, I guess. Hmm. Okay. Well, play this. Are you any good? I don't think you're that good. Um, just, just one. Actually, do we just play both of these? Because next turn we can get rid of this, which is a lot scarier. Oh, we shook it. Oh, we played it in the wrong order. What an absolute dummy. Yeah, that was pretty bad. Double strike and trample. <sighs> Alright, well, we're not blocking here. They have no cards in hand. Oh, they get to plus, though. Jesus. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Three, four, six, seven, eight. We go to two. Jesus, crying out loud. Alright, well... Yeah, that's probably going to cost us. There were quite a few mistakes that we just made right there. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We get ten life. And we can also kill this. How much mana do we have? We need one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, we can do it. We need four white, one, two, three, four. Okay, so three odds for two. Oh, we, yeah, I guess we can. Yeah, let's just play this, I guess. <clears throat> and we can still crack it to give pro here. Target creature or enchantment you control. I'll target this one. Submit one. Pro red. All right, we're a five. Did you two ever settle on a new game? Quit Death Stranding. We have not played Death Stranding for quite a while. I don't think we've settled on a new game, but we can't start anything until we move anyway, so. Uh, let's get rid of one of the Athenians, I guess. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna get rid of the weasel. The weasel, the reason if they if they have removal spells for our guys, uh, they just kill everything. Um. This give first strike? No, it just gives plus one plus oh, sure. We can also start making guys with the, with the castle item veil. So what does it cost? Three, one, two, three, four, and then we actually both. That's pretty sweet. Uh, let's do that. I'll take one point for this. Oh, that's a real good. Yep, that's probably better than the alternative. Uh, no attacks, because is this attacking creatures? Creatures you control? No, it's just creatures in general. Yep, no attacks. Oh, 
get to scry one and gain a life again. Uh, I will keep you on top for sure. So they have to double block, which means they trade with both, which is totally fine. I don't really like this trade here. Because if they want to double block, like, that's totally fine. I'll eat them both. Excavating part, evacuating part of a Florida because of an earthquake? I have never heard of such a thing. Okay, they died. Alright, we're 2 0 with this deck. I think it's pretty sweet. Cats are still a creature type, but dogs don't exist anymore, apparently. Only hounds. It's true. I have nothing to change in this deck. It's just been very fun so far. <sighs> this hand's iffy, but it's actually not bad. If we hit one land, we're good. If we hit two lands, good lord. The Caribbean plate is shifting off of the North American plate, causing earthquake and volcanic eruptions all along. I think Earth is just actually just done. I think it's just done with us. Hmm. I figured they were playing the red deck, because once you see the Chandra sleeves, you're like, oh. I see. Think I shocked this guy? No. I prefer the scientific explanations. Well, interesting. Look at old tin, look at old tin, rin tin, tinny tin tin. Is it just Starfield Mystic? No, I think it's Mega 2 2. Is Utah a bigger earthquake zone? I don't even know. I don't even know about Utah's uh, geological, you know, proclivities or whatnot. That's true, no more hurricanes. That is a truth. Thank you. Cyborg Yui, thanks so much, man. Welcome back. Really appreciate it. Oh, both these guys are just uh just getting there. Doing their doing their doing the deed. Get that dead weight out of there, my dudes. It's almost like we don't even have enough enchantments to fulfill both Timoret and Ephemia. This is the second time I've seen this guy coming at me. That's fascinating. There's no haste, though. No. So we can final payment this guy and get rid of the Timurite Calls the Dead, but I don't know if that's good or not.
feels pretty good. We can also just take five here. Go to 13. I'm actually not sure. We have three options here. We have Starfield Mystic, which I don't think it is. I think I want to keep this around. I think I do want to get rid of this guy. I think I could just pay five life for it. Maybe. I have one timeout. I'll just use that. I'm fine with it. Um, We are going to get another 2-2 at the end of this turn. Yeah, I'll pay five. And we gain a life here, so... Okay, well... Because this next turn we have like three zombies plus four from this, so we'd actually gain four life next turn. So I'm okay with that. Alright, um, what do we take out? Elspeth, not great. Cavalier, too slow. Uh, all the glitters... A little rough. Final payment's a little rough. Bring in Devout Decree, Heliod, Doggy, and one Kaya's Wrath. I believe that's what we were looking at last time. Mike needs to put the final payment down on his rat debt so they aren't following him across the country. They can do so real easily with the rat train nowadays. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's true. Yeah, once the once the old send them on down to rat train. Have you ever been outside and got to call on the rat train? <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus. Uh, I'm pretty sure that was. De this is definitely a cavalcade deck. They just haven't had a cavalcade. So. Yeah, I'll keep this, though. Turn one Al Seed. This card's so unexciting, but a 1 1 lifelinker, I'm like, oof, give it to me. Oh boy. Oh, Larry Biscuits. Um, do I take two for Eidolon here? Probably not. Because next turn we can just play the uh, the Eidolon and play. Oh, what if we draw Myers thing? Oh, there's hard casting that. That's cool. Have you ever been outside and had to call on the rat train? We're not playing that. We're just going to play. Why would you tap the goblet shrine? Come on. Get out of here with that. Wish this wasn't a sorcery, but that's... Fervent champ and a mountain. Sounds good. Mountain down. Lava coil. Get out of here. Um, do, 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 do. Robert of the Rich. I guess we're just gonna kill that dude. Yep, don't need that. That's land number 400. That guy's annoying. All these creatures are annoying. 
What's that about? I mean, to be fair, for most gaming stores, 16 people on a Tuesday night for standard is not terrible, right? Like. They have one card. I'm actually just going to make a token and block one of them. Have you ever gone outside and had to call on the rat tree? I guess they're going to kill it. Or they're not going to kill it. They're going to end up with it. That's a cool card that I enjoy greatly. Take nine more, scrub. Okay. Double treacherous blessing. All right. Let's. We'll see you later. I think I want Kaya's Blessings over Treacherous, uh... Anax? Why don't, why don't... I don't... I don't think I get it. Anax? Is that... Anax? Is that what you're saying right now? Is that what's going on? Uh... Yeah. I'm, I'm in. I'm in for this. I gained half of my godless shrine life back already. Now we're gonna draw the hound. Another mystic, actually, is not terrible. Oh, get him. Burp, burp. This guy again, huh? This old chestnut. Oh, this guy's an enchantment creature. That's pretty cool. Enchantment's put into a graveyard from the battlefield. Hmm. Hmm. So if we do that, we attack with two three threes. Interesting. Shockland might as well have been a scrubland. I'm at 20, bro. I got the full life total. Enchantment. Might be actually worth getting rid of Hateful Idol on as well. I just want to attack for three, though. Like, for six, rather. Embercleave is pretty rough, but I don't... Eh, we can just wait. No attacks. And the tur I'm just going to wait. Because they're also making a 1-1 one -one from this guy. Because if we let this resolve, then his devotion is four and they get another two two out of it. Or another another one one out of it rather. Oh, it's an enchantment you control, so these guys wouldn't have gotten pumped actually. 
it said a graveyard from the battlefield so i was like oh that counts but then it said you control and i was like oh that doesn't count This guy can't block, so I only have three. Come on, Archon or Kuranos. Kuranos. Kuranusums. Shock. Steamkin. Seems good. Nice. Oh, you don't do anything, so you may go. Twenty three to ten. That's a yikes for me, dog. Okay. Why why would you Oh good an ember cleave? Oh good. Wow, this is amazing. Well, none of these things do anything, unfortunately. So sometimes you just don't draw as well as you as you once did. <sighs> so pay four. On this guy, all right, that's not bad. Wow, we don't have that many. We, we, we do not have that many enchantments in our graveyard. I mean, they can get back their guy. Oh, they can get back and equip. Jeez, that's really good. I didn't know they have seven mana. So now it's a 3 3 that. Yikes. That's brutal. Nope. And Rickley is a cool magic card, that's for sure. You guys ever been cooking on three burners at once? <laughs> It's wild. What a time to be alive. I guess we're just taking eight. Because, you know, that's, that's my life now. And then we die. I guess we could hope for the... Uh... That's not it. Okay. Yep. Well, sometimes you lose. What can you do? Katie, did you decide to microwave your hot dog so you're not four burnering four burnering it? Oh yeah. Absolutely useless card that I'll never put in a constructed deck. My favorite. The worst part about four burners is that like keeping track of all and you're like, oh, 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 I got the I got the rice here, I got the beans here, I got the fajita meat here, I got the tacos here. And then you're like, oh, I gotta clean all these fucking dishes. I, gotta, I have to clean at least three pots and pans here, so. I'm going to keep this hand. I don't think it's... This might be one of the worst hands, but I think it's still keepable. I think it's still very, very keepable. Removal spell. Two top end cards that are nice. Definitely not ready for four. It's uh, You got to work up to it. You got to work up to it. I'm going to put this down because I don't want to have to go like... Plain swamp this. If I if like a third land is like a... It doesn't matter. I'm not going to even explain it to you guys. You guys wouldn't understand. You guys don't get it. Oh, that's decent though. Especially with a final payment in hand. We're gonna, we're gonna have to discard something now. Oh, that's not what I wanted to discard. I was just literally pulling it up to look at it. 
Super cool. Oh, it doesn't matter. I guess it doesn't matter. Oh, jeez. If I had a choice, I would have 100% discarded Sentinel's eyes there, but... Well, it looks like they're... I'm going to take out Meyer's Grasp. I've, we saw blue-white. So I'm going to bring in... Another Cavalier, Dawn of Hope, Agonizing Mems. I got one all that glitters. Scoops at the drop of a hat. That's hilarious. He's like, I'm out. What, did you play one treacherous thing? I'm done. I can't handle that. The sea. I wish I had. Uh, this is still keepable. We got one drop, two drop. I'm okay with it. I won like six games of draft once because my opponents kept scooping the Teferi. Wow, Brett. <laughs> I don't know what the problem was. I just kept playing Teferis in draft and they kept scooping. Wow. Unbelievable. I mean. this Cerberus. I like my Dragon Wolf, though. What up, Placid Laughter? Hey, look, speak of the devil. Stand by. I've got to. Sure. Tim, Tim, Timoret. Let's get rid of Treacherous Blessing. Sentinel Eyes we can still cast. Sentinel's Eyes, they're watching you. They're going to scoop when they don't draw land. Wow. Well, Mediocre Magic Man, you definitely called it, my dude. <laughs> God, that's hilarious. Jesus. Would you play a card that makes a 2 2? Nah, man, I'm out. And for that reason, I am out. Yep, same hand. I'll keep it. I like it. Keep keep them. <sighs> they see your every move. Oh, that, these are also really nice. I love these John Avon Mirage lands. Can't tell if mono red or just nice mountain. Imagine every time we did not draw a land frank and scoop, it would not be much. No, dude, I would have I would have no magic career. Look at that Rimrock Knight. That guy's gorgeous. I would love to see Hollow Notes at Tropicana Field, my dude. I'm a Hollow Notes fan. Well, 
that guy's good too. All right, so what if we go? Bane Slayer Angel, my dude. Five, six against the red deck seems pretty good, especially with lifelink. And if this guy dies, we draw two cards. Budge. Got him. <laughs> Welp. I'm hauling oats. <laughs> Katie, where are you hauling the oats to? Katie, can you respond to my Facebook message? God. Unbelievable. I'm trying to send people messages over here. And they're like, just, just. Are you also gonna? Are you ever gonna resub? Can you please? Can you please resub? Because it's starting to get on my nerves. Okay, I'm starting to, maybe starting to get upset. Man, maybe all that glitters isn't isn't that bad after all. What do we got? Four cart, four slots. Devout decree. Two dogs. I am pretty needy. Respond to this message. Send me a resub. Do all the things. All right, so we gotta take two more cards out. How many lands does this deck have? 24? Alright. Timurit calling oats. All your opponents just scoop and turn through. Yeah, it's not bad. It's a it's a decent way to it's a hell of a, it's a way to make a living, man. Oh, you must be at least 60 cards? Did I oh we took we put one in Kaya's wrath too. Okay, you know you can you can resub even if I'm not streaming at the time, right? Right, my love. What is this? Colin Oates, the hotline you don't need. Oh, I saw this the other day actually. Where you can literally call and they'll just play Hall and Oates songs for you. I was like, oh, that's pretty sick. If we can go turn one Deadwood and it turns you this, that seem oh, that's good too though. Alright, I'm actually feeling pretty good against uh, about this hand. I feel like you want more of this card. This card's bonkers. I almost want to wait on this. Like, if they play a guy, we get to go this into this and then eat their thing. It's not as fun when you read the message out loud. That's true. Well, I don't... Yeah, I don't read it out loud if I'm not streaming. Solid point. Well, that's the guy I was hoping it wouldn't be because my dead weight doesn't do anything against him, but. I think we're just going to play this and then play Godless Shrine here so that next turn we can play Archon. Right, but if a whole month goes by where she can't catch the stream, then I just lose out on that sub, you know, and that's just worse. When your girlfriend's not subbing to your stream. See that anger? He's so angry. Um, <laughs> modern problems require modern solutions. You don't get the, 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 the notice if you subscribe when not streaming. Why even subscribe at all? Wow. I hope that's not what people think. I don't even subscribe because I don't get the notice, so. Good lord. That would be so detrimental to my... This guy's legendary. Oh, you're just making the tutus? Sure. Sure, my dude. Oh, that's pretty good. And I'm just going to play 3-4 here. Oh, interesting. Actually, we could kill a lot of things. No, we can just play this and then just make a bunch of dudes next turn. That seems pretty good if they can't kill this. Oh, they're going to kill it. Fucking lava coil. Yep. Can a dude get a Kaya's Wrath? No, nah, he can't.
Oh man, my pizza's done. Jake, what kind of pizza did you get? I would love to. I would love to know, but considering you left before I could say that, I'm sure you're gone getting your pizza now. Well, that's pretty good. Alright, now we want that Kaya's Wrath. Nope, that ain't it. Oh, you're legendary, so that's not great. That's a yikes for me, dog. You can't you can block, right? Oh, no attacks. Yikes. Yeah, she ain't got no time to watch another streams. Man, I'm lucky when she can get into this chat. I'm just like, oh good, I like that you're here. I love it. If they have if they have the stupid shitbird card, then we're just This guy pump? No? Okay. I mean if they have Embercleave then Welcome to Bone Town. Population me. I don't understand the last one. The mic playing a two drop. Can, I, can you give me, give me some clarification on that one? Was it because like he's like, oh, you need somebody to me all these two? Oh, look, they had it. Oh, look, they had Ember Cleave, guys. They had Ember Cleave. Oh, look, we can't even play this because of the treacherous. That's so cool, dude. That's so cool. I wonder if this is just great here. I don't even know. Like, they're going wide. I'm gonna bring in the other Kaya's Wrath. Final payment seems just terrible. Treacherous Blessing, I also don't even like you. I'm sorry. I, I, I think you're... And it seems pretty hit or miss with the, against the red decks. Like, if they just get the nuts, then you're like, okay, you got the nuts. I'll keep this. Oh, all the glitters on the dog seems great. Put it on the dog! Die like you have lived, taking damage. How come this doesn't make black zombie enchantment creature tokens? That would that seems like it, what, the thing we want. Oh, it's a little scorch spitter. Oh yeah, you're fashionably to the party. That's cool. I'm actually just gonna play this. I think playing a three drop here is much more significant. Um, do I want you? However, I do actually want this. Because if I can go planes this into glitters, it's not terrible. Thank you! Jam King 4, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. You know when you use three burners while cooking and then you eat what you made, then you're way too full? Yeah. I, I also know the feeling of like, hey, I used the th I made th I made use three burners and I made all this food, and then I'm like, I don't want to clean any of this up. I know that one too. Well, they seem to be doing well for themselves. Oh boy, well, we we're hoping for a land there.
we can hit another land here, it'd be insane. And they don't happen to oh jeez god. Can we just double block here? I don't really want to take eight, but at the same time, all that glitters is gonna be one, two, three, four, so plus four plus four. It's like a six. Yeah, all my blocks. Are not ideal, but seven eight life link, my dude. <laughs> Seems good. I mean, we're probably still dead. That's how I feel. But. Okay. Oh, well, now they have four creatures, and now they can play Ember Cleave, which they always have for two mana. So. You know, like you do. And if we block here, it's just. the end. So. Oh, they didn't have Embercleave. Oh, that's a big game. Well, that's fascinating. Oh, well, they couldn't kill the other guy, so that's interesting. Okay, okay. Well... Hmm. How do we survive here? Yeah, they need to attack with four. You're right. I thought it was creatures they control. That's true. That's true. I feel like this should get flying. Every time I see all the glitters, I think it gives flying because it's obviously a creature with wings. So they can actually double block here, right? And then it's one, two, three, four, five, six. But I think we've taken out a lot of things if we do that. And we get to draw a card here, so that's pretty good. Wish we drew that first. And if they want to double block, that's okay with me. Now I feel like we're turning the corner, as, as, as the magic coverage team might say. This is all fine, I guess. They're tapped out, right? So you take one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. But we get to block here. Go back up to six. Twelve. Now we have two blockers. Block, block. We take one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen. So I think we're dead. No, but we're gaining six. So, oh well, that's yeah, that's probably the end. Fucking taxis! Unbelievable. Amazing. Love the red deck. Either way, guys, thank you for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on twitch.tv slash franklinport, patreon.com slash franklinport. Cool stuff, Inc. Every Wednesday, I have new articles going up. And you can also find me at manatraders.com. You can get 20% off the first three months of any subscription with the link and promo code down below. So be sure to use those. And uh, let me know what you think of this deck. I think it was pretty sweet. So, uh, I think it's all right. I think I want another Archon. I think Archon's great. 
Um, Cavalier of Dawn's cute. It's not an enchantment, though. And the one of is just like, I'd rather have more consistent cards in the deck than like a random one of. But either way, I thought the deck was great. Thank you guys for watching. I will see you next time. Hopefully you enjoyed this and uh, I'll see you later.